and bones don't appear. So there are a lot of still improvements that can should be made in wave painting, but we'll have to for now endure this reality here. Okay, so why I'm forgetting the essential. The new technique here. This is a good spot, right? Let's show this. Let's make a highlight here, folks. So let's say I want to wave paint these vertices here. You see, I'm not ve being very successful. So, uh, okay, so maybe, yes, but you see it's dangerous and I something is not helping. So there are even worse situations, right? So the good news is that the gradient tool now has got this linear and radial stuff. And the radial is the new because the, sol the linear will sort of destroy everything, right? But the radial is local. So we can do this kind of very rational and not organic, but yeah, organic like we have instead of linear, this is radial. So we can make balls of waves right so these spheres of influence on the so this is a game changer for wave painting there are certain circumstances that we get with crazy waves in some mesh there is no the vertices they spike like crazy and it seemed no way to solve this with any wave painting maybe just control x to set waves but then it's crazy then you want something more organic solution that this is the solution radial gradient and so then you can yeah so this is the way to go here that would be helpful not sure if they'll be useful for the rest but the rest of the things we're doing but that probably is good to know blender 4 or one of the four point something that got it 